Harmonious color combinations are called color schemes. Colors can influence moods, thoughts, meaning, and have magical effects on people's psyche. This video will cover four basic color schemes. Complementary colors, analogous colors, warm colors, and cool colors. Complementary colors. Colors that are directly opposite each other on the color wheel, such as red and green, blue and orange, and violet and yellow. When complements are mixed together, they form the neutral colors of brown or gray. Note that this term is spelled differently than the word complementary, which means gift. Complementary colors have been used by artists for centuries to create contrast as well as other principles of design. Edward Munch's painting, The Scream, uses complementary colors for contrast of color and value, which brings forth a sense of emotional tension in the piece. Sandy Skoglin's photograph, Revenge of the Goldfish, uses complementary colors to create contrast, which creates movement for the eye and helps frame the central figure. Robert Odie's stained glass window, Gable Rhododendron, uses complementary colors to create contrast of foreground and background, creating emphasis for the flowers. Analogous colors. Any two or more colors that are next to each other on the color wheel and are closely related. For example, blue, blue-green, and green all have the color blue in common. Families of analogous colors include the warm colors, red, orange, and yellow, and the cool colors, green, blue, and violet. Analogous colors are sometimes referred to as adjacent colors. Analogous colors can evoke moods and feelings in an artwork. In Van Gogh's Starry Night, the analogous blues and blue-greens create a sleepy mood in a painting in which dynamic brushstrokes keep your eyes moving throughout the painting. But in Van Gogh's Sunflowers, a warmer, more inviting feeling is created with the use of yellows, orange yellows, and oranges. Warm colors. Colors are often described as having temperature, as warm, reds, oranges, and yellows, or cool, greens, blues, and violets. Warm colors are often associated with fire and the sun. They appear on one side of the color wheel and opposite cool colors. Psychologically, warm colors are said to be stimulating and passionate. Optically, warm colors generally appear to advance, coming toward the viewer. Cool colors. Colors are often described as having temperature, as warm, reds, oranges, and yellows, or cool, greens, blues, and violets. Gee, I wonder I heard that before. Cool colors are often associated with water, sky, spring, and foliage, and suggest cool temperatures. They appear on one side of the color wheel and opposite warm colors. Psychologically, cool colors are said to be calming, unemphatic, depressive, and optically, they generally appear to recede. You can see the psychological effects of warm and cool colors in these two paintings of the Seine River in France by Claude Monet. You can witness the mood swing warm and cool colors have on the human psyche. One is serene and calm, the other vibrant and awake. Thank you for watching this video. I hope you have a better understanding of color schemes. Stay tuned for more videos about art. Later.